Hello guys, welcome back to some more God of War Chains of Olympus. In the last episode, we made our way out of the depths of Tartarus and managed to kill Charon. And we managed to obtain the wrath of Charon in the process. And this episode now, we have now arrived at this temple, where Kratos saw Calliope in the distance. So Calliope is right inside the temple and Kratos has got to go catch up with her. Let's go find Calliope before she gets herself into any trouble. The Temple of Persephone. Ah, so that's what this temple's called. <laughs> Hope Clypey doesn't go too far ahead from us. Who knows what lies ahead. The Temple of Persephone. The Domain of Persephone. Sorry if I'm pronouncing that word wrong, by the way. Wife of the Hades and Goddess Queen of the Underworld. Okie dokie then. The Plight of Persephone. In her youth, Persephone Persephone was seized by Hades and carried off to the underworld as his bride. Her mother, Demeter, goddess of the earth, refused to let the earth bear fruit until she was returned to her. Zeus consented, but because Persephone tasted the fruit of Hades, the pomegranate she was cursed to forever spend part of the years for her husband in the underworld. Thus was born the seasons. Oh, there's a chest here. I'll take that. Get all the orbs I can gather. Hope I can upgrade quite a few abilities before we get to the final boss in the game. It's always nice to do that in a God of War game. The rule of Persephone. Persephone. Tragic queen sorrowfully rules over the dead to return to the earth in spring. It's marked by the flowering of the meadows. Her return to the underworld in full sees the dying of plants and the halting of growth. Now I've read them. Can I smash these? Oh yes, I can smash these. You may as well get a bit more orbs out of it. Okay, let's go find Calliope. Oh, I've got this big thing. Oh, get off. Oh, okay, I'll stop pressing that hard enough. Stop pressing those buttons fast enough. There we go. Let's use this. Let's use the bomb there, Zeus, since this does much more damage than the Blades of Chaos at this point. Get out of here. Get off. She had to punch him, I think. That's a nice bit of Ah, fish him off now. One taken out. Hopefully we don't get. Oh, we got another one. Oh, great. Fair life is miles away in the temple now. See all the all the enemy. At least not life can deal with these enemies though. Just imagine that. I've lost quite a bit of health so far. I need to put my I need to put myself together. Okay, that's him taken out. I just got to take out. These little fellas over here. Where'd the other guy go? Oh, there he is. Is that all of them? Yes, it is. Good. Ooh, orb chests. There's going to be loads of orb chests in this temple. Oh, what's in here? It's gonna be some more orbs, isn't it? I think we found all the Gorgonites and the Phoenix Feathers at this point. So at this point on the game, so if we fight come across chests like that, all it's gonna be is orbs, health, and magic inside of it. So Clypey hasn't disappeared far away before she would have. I thought she would be miles for much further away in the temple at this point. I'm going to destroy these things on the wall here because these things will shoot out this light as you can see here. And obviously that's the same light that those um, slivery enemies can shoot out. And obviously if Kratos gets stuck in that, it will freeze Kratos for a short period of time. Obviously because there's quite a few enemies around here, it won't be, it, all it takes is one hit of an attack for Kratos to break to death. So you have to be very quick with this. I really need to know if more than anything because of the encounter in the previous room. I 
I love the amount of damage this thing does now, though. The, the amount of damage the Gauntlet of Zeus does now. Um, once we've completed this fight, I'm going to have a look and see what abilities I can upgrade. Okay, there's one more enemy right here. I see him gone. Is that all of them? No. There we go. That's all of them. Okay. Let's see what I can upgrade here. Light of Dawn. Charon's Wrath. Blades of Chaos as well. To upgrade the Blades of Chaos since I've got a nice amount of orbs for me. I may as well get a good Blades of Chaos with maximum power. Blades of Chaos, increased damage with Tartarus Rays and Toss Rage in the air. Yep, the Blades of Chaos are now maxed out. So I definitely want to upgrade Charon's Wrath as well, that would be a good ability to upgrade. So I can save my progress here, but I'm not going to do that. I am going to fill my health and... How am I doing for magic? Uh, I've got quite a bit of magic, but I may as well. May as well have full magic. In here, we're getting more enemies to fight, aren't we? Yep, I called it. That's a nice hit there. What? Should do this. It's quite not a magic ability, actually. It's a factor unlock it quite early on in the game as well. It's quite a decent magic ability to use, actually. Did not mean to do that again, but I'll do it again anyway. Can net all the armors off that big guy. And he's dead. Haha. <laughs> We're gonna have another one to deal with, surely. Yep, I thought we'd have another one to deal with. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. I think. Does a nice amount of damage. Now it's much bigger to its full power. It does do one nice amount of damage at this point. Well, it actually at this point I should use the Charon's Wrath a bit more, but when I get that upgrade a bit more, we'll definitely start using that a bit more. Here we go. Gone, gone. I've got some help from it as well. Whoa. Is that all of them? Yes, it is. I just want to see what's in here quickly. Health and magic. I could definitely do it. Actually, no, I could do it with magic actually more than health at this point. Can't do pretty well for wolves. I'm going to upgrade my Charon's Wrath quickly. Unlock strike additional enemies. Yeah, I'll take that. So I need 7,000 orbs to upgrade to his next power. Okay. Alright. I don't think I'll upgrade uh, all the abilities before we get to the end of the game, but you never know. I think Charon's Wrath is definitely going to be the ability I'm going to focus on upgrading the most at this point. I 
I don't think I'll bother using much magic on these guys. I'm just going to grab them and just take them out this way. Oh, ah, shit. I hope he's the last enemy. Oh, no, maybe not. This one. There we go. Oh, we've got quite a few more enemies around here. When I thought we'll deal with all the enemies, there's always one more that appears out of nowhere, or two of them that appear out of nowhere. Is it all of them? Hopefully, Sharon's just up ahead. Clippy, please stop running away from me. We'll finish this fight off first, then I'll open up that chest. Almost got five, I might as well wait. There we go, Sharon's wrap out. I don't know if it's working very well against this guy, though. Oh, oh. yeah, perhaps it is working pretty well on them then. hits in here, there we go. He's dead. Perfect. So all of them? So far, no more enemies have appeared. Ah, here we go. Hopefully this will be the last enemy. But science tells me that's not going to be the case. Nope, didn't think so. Oh. Oh. Fucking hell. Okay, I not expecting to do that. He's dead. Is there another one around here? Just make sure another one hasn't spawned over here. There you go, that's all of them. Should refill my health. Ah, this will lead us outside. Did Clypey seriously manage to move this crank by herself? Kratos was like trying to put a bit of effort into moving the crank, so if Clypey did manage to move his crank, I'd be very impressed. Hang on, what's this? Aha! More orbs, perfect. I'll take that. Oh great, more of these. This temple is just literally just a room of enemies, literally after a room of enemies. It's pretty much pretty much what we deal with as we go through a temple to catch up with Calliope. There's a nice little charge attack there. Get off. Uh-oh. Oh, that broke out of that just in time. Oh, that was close. Just gotta get rid of these birds. So in case I do get frozen again, at least these guys won't be able to. At least they won't be able to take me out if I do get frozen again. Get off. There we 
we go. Is that all of them? Titan Tales, that's not going to be all of them. Nope. That was a nice evade there. Whoa. 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 Need to get some stronger attacks in. Got a bit cornered, a bit stuck here. I'm not managing to chip away any of his health, any of armor yet either. So I'm just going to get some magic out already. There we go. That'll do some damage. There we go. Is that the last one? Yes, it is. Oh. More chests. Nice. Go go check if there was another room on this side. Oh, just these. Okay, I'm going to upgrade Charon's Wrath quickly before we go any further. Make sure that's upgraded. Strikes additional enemies. I'll take it now that's maxed out. Nice, I'm ready. Another room of more enemies to deal with, most likely. Hmm, maybe not. I was going to say, the amount of times we're going into a room and getting more and more enemies to deal with, it's going to be repetitive at this point as we get further into the temple. But I'm alright for magic, so... Actually, no, it's not completely full, actually. Not that really mags, it's almost full anyway, but... Most I have 100% magic to 95% magic. The Groves of Persephone. Calliope! Calliope, where are you? Kratos looked, but his daughter was nowhere to be seen. In the middle of the room sat a graceful figure, a figure he recognized all too well. Persephone, wife of Hades, Queen of the Undead. Where is my daughter, witch? Choose your words carefully, ghost of Sparta. You address the goddess of the underworld. Your daughter is well. She lives among the pure souls in the Elysian fields. Lead me to her. Have you forgotten, Kratos? The Olympians need you. They slumber at the hand of Morpheus. I have faithfully served the gods, yet they do not give me what I ask. I grow weary of their demands. The gods on Olympus failed me too, Kratos. I was betrayed by Zeus and tricked by my husband Hades. Now I am to stay in the underworld as queen of the dead, to serve the fallen and care for them as my own children. Persephone! I demand to see my daughter! As you wish. If Calliope is your true desire, I can help you. But be warned, Ghost of Sparta. The world of man will suffer because of your choice. I care little for the world and its suffering! Where is she? If you are to see your daughter again, you must become worthy of Elysium. Cast your weapons at the Forsaken Tree, and let it release the evils of your past. Only then will you be free of your sins and be granted passage 
these divine gates. You have done well, Kratos. Walk through the portal and find the one you seek. Calliope! Father? My child. Oh. Why did you go? I am here now, child. And I will not leave you again. I have watched over you pathetic mortals for a thousand years, and it is always the same. Serving yourself before the needs of others has always been your flaw. But no matter. For now you serve my purpose. It is time for all that came before to end. The Titan will fulfill his role and finish what I have started. I released Atlas. You? As you were pathetically disarming yourself, Atlas completed the task I set him out to do. With the power of the sun in his hands, it is only a matter of time before he destroys the pillar that holds the world. And Olympus with it. But why? Do you think it was my choice to wed a man I did not love? Live a life I did not choose? I was betrayed by the very gods that once saw me as their own, but no more. Once the pillar is destroyed, the world will revert into chaos. And what is to become of you? I will have my peace and be free from this miserable existence. I will perish, but it is my choice. Father, what's happening? I'm scared. In your selfish choice to be with your daughter, you have caused her ruin. No. Elysium falls too, Kratos. She will perish. No! I will not let the gods take her from me again! Father! The choice was clear to him, yet impossible to make. To stay with his daughter meant the end of the world and the end of her. To stop Persephone and Atlas would mean forsaking his daughter forever. While his hatred and anger for the gods grew ever stronger, he knew there was but one thing to do. Father, please! Man, this is painful. Kratos has to sacrifice Calliope to stop Persephone and Atlas. Hearing Calliope's pleas as well just makes this really difficult to do. Father! Father, no! I ain't got my blades or anything, so I've just got to grab, just grab these guys, press over and I just grab them. Kratos soon realized that what he gained in humanity he lost in power. You get loads of orbs from doing this stuff. He would need to become the monster he once was if he was to defeat Persephone. Okay, I've got my blades back. But I need my, all my health and all my magic back. Okay, so I'm getting some of my magic back. 
regained sun shield. So before we get to the end again, hopefully I can have enough orbs to upgrade all my bits. And there's only there's only one more ability I need to upgrade for, and that's a light of dawn, I believe. Ah, gotta be very careful. So I ain't got much health on me at this point. That was a nice hit there. There we go. Can take out all of them. We got more of these enemies to deal with in just a moment. He would need to become the ghost of Sparta once again if he was to save his child. You regained light of dawn. Good. Ah. I don't think I can upgrade any of my abilities at the moment when this treasure. I might be able to, I don't know. No, I can't upgrade anything at the moment. Yeah, I, I thought that would be the case. So if I keep grabbing these, I should be able to get my abilities back, might I? Yeah, there we go. If I keep doing this, I'll be able to get my abilities back. Even if there are loads of enemies still standing. Kratos knew his destiny was not with Calliope. The fates were never that kind. Okay, I'm gonna finish off Freddy's guys before we go any further. At least I've got all my abilities back. It's now time to take on Persephone. So when we head up there, we are going to have our encounter with Persephone and take down Persephone. I was going to do this thing. Okay, I lost all my magic, but at least they're all dead. Okay, Calliope is nowhere to be seen. Okay, Calliope's disappeared, so now we are now going to head up here and take on Persephone. Before we go any further, I'm going to upgrade my Light of Dawn. Hopefully, once I've upgraded this time, hopefully it'll be Light of Dawn maxed out. Radiant Sun R1 and hold square. Okay, so that, I think that is all my abilities maxed out. Yes, it is. I've upgraded all of my abilities in the game. Very nice. Okay, we've got another encamp. We've got some more enemies to take out before we can head up to the top and take down Persephone. I just like it when these enemies appear, so what I've got to do is just go out to impress the circle button and just take them out. to get some heavy attacks in. Come here. Whoa. Ah, oh, shit. Battery of Patrol 1 is low. Again. I really need to remind myself to put my PS3 controller on charge. That's him gone as well. Oh, we've got this, this big fella now. We've had loads of battles ever since entering the Temple of Persephone. Almost got taken out at one point where I'm actually need, need to get frozen to death for minor birds managed to hit me, but luckily I managed to break out just in time. That's a 
big fat thing over. We've, we've got loads of enemies to deal with. Well, if we can take out all these enemies that this bit's going to offer us, then we're definitely prepared for Persephone. That's not quite all of them yet. So all of them now? Okay, there we go. Now we've finally taken them all out. How am I doing for health and magic? I was there for each three from a health and magic fully before we go take on Persephone. Okay, so when we head up there, we're going to have our boss fight. That we're going to be taking on the final boss in the game, who is going to be Persephone. So next episode, guys, it's going to be the finale where I do end off the God of War Chains of Olympus Let's Play. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the episode, please be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more keep updated with God of War Chains of Olympus episodes to my channel. And next episode, we'll take on Persephone and take her down. I'll see you guys in the finale. Thank you so much for watching. This is Goldie X, and I'm out.